Once again, let us give praise and thanks to God because He's good and indeed His love endureth forever. King David says in Psalm 107, verse 1, Give praise to God because His love endureth forever. Today is day number two, and I want us to look at another reason why we ought to give praise and thanks to God. Before that, I want to remind you that from the 5th to the 15th of January, we are praising God and we are committing all our needs and cares to Him because He has told us that He cares for us. So from the 5th to the 15th, it's going to be 10 days of fasting and prayers. If you have any special request you want us to pray over, you can send it to our WhatsApp number on the screen right now and we would work on them for you. Today, I want us to take our Bibles and open to 1 Corinthians chapter 1, verse 4. And this is another reason why we ought to thank God this new year. And that reason is because of the grace that He has given to us through Jesus Christ. In 1 Corinthians chapter 1, verse 4, the Bible says, I always thank my God for you because of His grace given you in Christ. It is because of the grace of God that is why we are here. Listen, sometimes when I sit down and think about how unfaithful I've been, when I think about how sometimes I disappoint God, yet He continues to love us anyway, then I cannot just keep my mouth shut but to give thanks to Him, just like the Apostle Paul here is declared. I thank God because of His grace. I thank God because of His grace for our lives. We deserve to die. We broke his law, but he took the first step in sending his only begotten son to die in our place. And because of that, he gave us what is known as grace. Basically, it means a pardon, another opportunity, another shot to life, another chance to come to him again. The grace of God has bridged the gap that sin created between us and God. If you have no reason to give thanks to God, then let me remind you of an important reason, and that is because of His grace. It is because of His grace that is why you have sight to see. It is because of His grace that is why you can hear. It is because of His grace that is why you have not been consumed by the enemy. Spend today thanking God for His grace. Thank Him for His grace that He has spared you and given you life today.